Now let's face it, the TV license itself is a little bit scammy, isn't it? And the way they enforce it certainly is a little bit scammy. But I stumbled across this post on Mumsnet the other day, and this isn't just scammy, it's downright ridiculous. Have a look at this with me and we'll have a chat about it. I've just moved house, and being a law-abiding citizen, I not only pay for a TV license, but I let them know where I am and therefore what property the £12.82 I pay them every month is to cover. So I've done an online change of address. Fairly basic stuff. So why did it cost me £16.50 to give them this information? None of my other utility suppliers charge me for communicating with them. That didn't sound right to me. £16.50 to change your address as TV licensing started doing something new to make up the numbers to try and make a few more quid. Now they're charging you 16 and a half quid to change your address. But reading on in this, it appears that she has fallen privy of it's not a scam because they are a legitimate business, but it's scummy. Let's put it like that. So this is what the woman typed into Google. I did the same search. Have a look. Uh, so after turning ads on, because I run an ad blocker, obviously, I typed into Google, change address TV license. And it comes up with these two ads. And one of them's legit, look, tvlicensing.co.uk. And the other one is movemy.co.uk. So I guess we need to have a look at movemy.co.uk, don't we? Seems odd that someone would charge for this. Let's have a look. So when you click the link, this is the first page that you come to. Look, TV license, change address, moving house checklist, TV license. Nice logo and everything. It looks proper pucker and legit, doesn't it? Now, I can see how people would fall for that. It's pretty legitimate looking. And to be fair, they are a legitimate business. Scummy, but legitimate. Charging people 1650 to change the address on their TV license. When you have to fill out this form to do it, which is what you'd have to do with TV licensing anyway, or just even just a quick phone call. It doesn't make any sense. Well, let's hit their frequently asked questions and find out a bit more about them. Frequent questions, how long does it take? It takes three to five minutes to fill in, depending on the number of suppliers. So they don't just do TV licensing. They can change your energy supplier and your phone supplier and all of that. But we're only on this for the TV licensing bit. Three to five minutes is how long it would take you yourself to change your address if you had a TV license. How much does it cost? Our service starts at £16.50 for your first account provider and can add as many additional accounts as you want for only £3 each. So like I said, they are a legitimate business. Scummy, but legitimate. You know, charging people £16.50 to fill out a form that you could fill out for free on the proper website or just like a quick two-minute phone call. To me, it's bang out of order. It's bang out of order. And I just wanted to address this because I hope not many other people fall for it. By going by the... Uh, the mum's net thread, you know, they did pick up on that pretty quickly. But, you know, you type in TV license change address, it's top. They're spending money on ads and it looks a bit pucker. And um, I'm surprised they haven't got a better domain name. What is it? Movemy.co.uk. I'm surprised they haven't, like, bought movemytvlicense.co.uk. So I have just given them an idea because then more people would fall for that, wouldn't they? Is that just odd? I mean, the TV license itself is scummy, and then you get scummers like this, you know, preying on older people, vulnerable people, or people that are not so tech savvy. It just makes me sad inside, really. So I thought I'd just bring you this quickly in the hope that some other people don't click it and pay them the £16.50. And, well, to be honest, I hope you cancel your TV license, not move it to your new address, obviously. But if you do have one, please don't fall for something like this. And speak to people like your elderly relatives or people who aren't too tech savvy and let them know to not fall for stupid, ridiculous nonsense like this. As I say, they're not going to get scammed out of their entire life savings, but they are going to get billed for something that you can do yourself in the exact same amount of time for free. Isn't it? Let me know what you think about this down in the comments and I'll see you in another video again soon. Thanks for watching.